and rolling up and down the finger. Into the palm. And head to the pinky. And go to the thumb. Down to the wrist. Uh, to the knuckles. And then pull the ball between the thumb and the forefinger and squeeze. <clears throat> Middle finger. Ring finger. And draw the other hand, index, middle, ring, thank you. We'll toss it up in the air today. Three, two, one. Keep the ball on the floor, assess the feet. Step on the ball, press down a few times right in the middle. Uh, up to the knuckles, press on each going across. Hey, Jonathan. Roll across. And go to the middle of the foot and wiggle the toes. Press the toes into the ball. Raise and separate. Press again. Wiggle again. And screw. Three, two, one, release. Go to the other foot and repeat. Middle of the foot. Knuckles. Cross the knuckles. And then we put a new wiggle. Press. <laughs> We're going to separate. Press. Wiggle. And scribble. Three, two, one, release. Reassess. Get the ball out of the way and shake the tree. And center two breaths.
list of toys. Swing it to the audience. And the uh, center, we do some primordial tai chi. And from Canada, the lower down to end, palms facing the body, bring them up, bend the knees, bring them in. Come on up as the hands go down. Right hand to the right side. Look at it. So, third eye level, bring it back down. Left hand up to the left side. Bring it back down. <clears throat> On the chibo, bring it up the spine, out, down, back up to the heart. Bring it over to the right and look. Bring it to the left. Bring it back to the right. Come back to center, right hand below, left hand up. Bring the right hand up as the left hand goes down, and then right hand goes down, left hand comes up. Give it on the left heel, go a quarter turn, throw the pitch. The left hand gathers chi, right hand gathers chi, left hand gathers chi, give it on the heel, go a quarter turn, right hand down, the left hand is up, the right hand comes up. The left hand comes up. Pivot. Pivot. Left hand out. Right hand out. The left hand. Both hands go out and gather from below. Left hand is inside the right palm coming up to the crown. And down slowly. The front of the spine. And take two breaths. Around and take some steps forward. And then elbow towards the opposite knees. And slap the opposite heel. Left it behind you. And then cross uh, step with a twist and a punch. And then walk, or march, or jog. And we're going to do the balance routine today. Get a couple of sit and stands to build up those leg muscles, but uh, not uh, particularly onerous if you want to do it. Squats, go ahead. Anything else is good too? It could be what you're doing, just be safe. Sun just came out. And uh, we'll do some bands after class. My sprint in five, four, three, two, two.
11. And 30, two breaths. Move your left finger, raise the hand. Come on, back down if you were up and bend back if you can. Back to center, lower to one side, bend to one side. And then the other. Back to center. Lower the hands, push out of the chest. Come on down, bring one arm up, one hand, one arm below. Use a strap or a belt if you need to. And pull. Hmm. Not a good place to sleep, my friend. And reverse the position of the hands. And come on back down and shrug. Roll and show the back. And four. Then the arms and rotate. Go the other way. One palm down, one palm up, flip flop. Bring one arm in, press at or above the elbow. <clears throat> and then the other. And put it down behind the back, let's see down and in. And then the other. Grab both elbows, rock side to side. Form a T, squeeze the shoulder blades together and hold. And release. And squeeze. Release. And squeeze. And release. Come on down, look at the back. Go the other way. Nod. And go your shoulder. Mm. 
Welcome. Come to your center, bring your hand up across the top of your head, cup your ear, chin up, eyes looking at the ceiling as you tug gently. Chin down on the collarbone, look to the floor and tug. And then repeat the other way. And shit. Come on up. Tuck in the chin. And pet like a pigeon. And do a side lunge. Go the other way. And come on up, Edward. I stick. We are teasing. You chin stick with you. Starting with the dynamic swimmers in one direction. And then the other. Above the head, back and forth, side to side. Behind the waist, twist at the waist. Bring the stick to just above the knees. Hinge at the waist, bring the hands out front in between the knees. Keep the spine neutral, head back and pull up. Three, two, one, bring the stick around front. Hold on with two hands, step back, hinge at the waist, stretch the shoulders and upper body. Come on up. We're going to stick across the body. Hinge at the waist as you bring the other arm under the armpit, grab the shoulder and cut. Repeat on the other side. And I'll bring the stick to the side of the foot. Press out the top hand, pull in with the bottom, inch at the waist. Repeat on the other side. Yes, go. Come on up. Bring the stick in front of one foot, bring the toes about six inches away, drop the stick to the collarbone, slide down, lift the sole of the foot, wiggle it side to side.
Come on up. At least we got the other with the other leg. Come on up. Press the sole of the foot of the first leg against the stick. And then the other. <clears throat> Bring one foot forward. You run the balls of the feet on the other foot. Come on down, stretch the flexors. And then reverse the position of the legs. Come on up. Grab one leg by the shins, ankle, or toes and stretch the quads. Then the other. And come on down, bring the first foot in front, push the knee towards the back, hinge at the waist. And then the other. Yeah, come on up. Grab the stick in the middle by two hands, one hand or a finger or two. Step back up on the toes for a second, back on the heels for a second, and we'll rock and roll for about 15. All right, um, let's put the stick down, <clears throat> grab a chair. We're gonna do uh, 10 sit to stands. I'm gonna move my arms around, but um, you don't have to, wherever you feel safest, keep them. Um, just make sure you sit down all the way. One, two, Three, four, five, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, let's go behind the chair. We're gonna put our hands on the back for support. You're gonna come up uh, on the toes of one foot, and if you can, lift it off the ground, but you're gonna close your eyes. Make sure you got uh, solid contact here, and try to balance with your eyes closed. Whoops. Three, two, one, and then try the other one. Three, 
three, two, one. All right, get, get the chair out of the way. And we're going to do Brad's walk. So we're going to start going heel to toe. And then backwards or turn around, whatever feels right for you. And then come up on your toes. And then you turn around and go backwards. Up on your heels. Over on the fifth metatarsal. You know, on the first metatarsal. More like a duck. And of course, like a pigeon. All right. So we're going to do some side stepping. Bring your foot across and up. Even them out, then bring it behind. Go the other way. And then do it as fast as you can. Same thing. All right, come to center. We're going to tap front, go back to center, tap the little right or left, whichever, out to the side, tap back, and tap across. We'll do three on each foot. I'm starting, let's start with the right foot. Front, right side, back, across, front, right. And then the left foot. All right, I'm going to turn around. I'm going to call out the foot and the position on the clock. You should tap left 11, right two, right five, left seven, right 12. Left six, right three, left nine, left three, right nine, right three, left seven, left ten, right two, right nine, left three. All right. Let us um, do some breathing here. We're going to do four rapid breaths in through the nose, separate breaths. And then four out through the nose. And then we're going to do eight of those cycles on the last one. After we exhale, we're going to hold for 10 seconds. Here we go.
And then rub the hands together. I think I did at least nine now. I get carried away. Rub those hands together. Give it a bit chi and form a chi bone. And center. Two breaths. And let us open our heart. Pause. Exhale. Send it out. And the center with two breaths. Let's bring down Chief and Bo. And go down and gather from blue. And ah. <laughs> Another good one. All right, good. Thank you. Yeah. Have a Wolf. good day. Whoops. Wolf bark. It's, what's that? Wolf bark. Wolf bark, yeah. And I hear saws going and hammers hammering and busy day out there. All right. Um, we're going to do some bands for anybody who is sticking around. I am going to um, get mine. And let us start by putting it on the opposite shoulder and doing some tricep extensions. And then move to the other shoulder. Bow and arrow. Other way. All right, we're going to put the band around the legs. I'm going to use a slightly heavier band for this. And 
you can either put it around your ankles or uh, that's too difficult. You can have it up above your knees. But what we're doing is that good old fashioned favorite, the monster walk. I'm going to turn around. And come back. All right. Let's go into athletic stance. Knees slightly bent, hinging at the waist. Step to the side. The ladder is walking. And then we'll get down on the ground. Bring the veins up to above the knees. Go on the sides. And do some plain shadows. And then go to the other side. And then bring the hand to the feet, line your back. And we'll do some bicycles. And then uh, we get up. Put the bands behind the back, around the wrists. And pull out, hold for a second, and back in. And for one. And 10. And then bring it to the front, make an X, cross it over, around the wrist, and you said you're done. <laughs> Hands are facing in towards the body, you pull out, 
squeeze the shoulder blades together and back in. Hold on that last one. Yeah. Very good. I think I'm going to turn on the fan. Oof. All right. Great to see you, Jonathan. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm finishing up uh, my move. I'm going down to North Carolina. Uh, well, I'm doing